Dallas Mavericks started the game with a 15-2 run. They started the second quarter with a 15-2 run, but they can't shake the Clippers. Just a five-point game. 22 for Luka Doncic in the first half as the Mavs try to even the series with the Clippers. American Express Halftime Report, Studio J here in Atlanta. Ernie and Shaq, Kenny and Chuck, thanks for being with us on another long playoff day as we wrap up a triple header. Uh, American Express teammates, uh, we got uh, a trio of Dallas Mavericks led by Luka Doncic with his 22. Kristaps Porzingis got 10, and look at Boban Marjanovic making the most of it, his eight minutes of play in the first half with 10 points and eight, count them, eight rebounds. I hope we get some Boban Marjanovic pictures out of this crew here at halftime. Am I, am I in the right direction? You're in the right direction, 100%. And Chuck. Yes, sir. As much as you've been saying Portland, 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 I've been saying Dallas. The Clippers are in the same immediate danger that the Los Angeles Lakers are. You're out of your mind. All right, I'm just letting you know. I'm just letting you know they're in that same immediate danger. Come on, you're out of your mind. But but one of the things, oh, you can, you, you, they saying you're out of your mind with Portland, but I'm saying Dallas. But one of the things about being an NBA player, if you do your job, then good things happen for your team even when you're not the best player. Because what Boban is doing, he says, my job is to set screens. <laughs> so I'm moving in. Again, I'm going to go set the screen because it didn't work. We didn't get it. We didn't get anything out of it. But now freeze it here. <laughs> so now once we freeze it here, he says, I'm not going to let any little guard guard me. I don't know who's laughing in my ear. <laughs> We're just looking at your untucked shirt. Go ahead. That's do your okay. thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had to do it because it's, it's, it's hot back there. I know. There. It's hot back there. Let's go ahead. Like let's do your thing. Yeah, let's get it all out. Looks like so, a pamper. Yeah, the, the whole thing is you cannot allow little guards to guard you. So what happens with what, what Boban says? I'm going into the post. Freeze it there. In the paint, this is where you say you want everybody at, Shaq, right? Yep. Boom. Okay, that's a dunk, without question. Do your job. Spread. I wish we still had it from the beginning because he spread it down. So now he, oh, okay, we're going back. Go, go, go. So he's spreading down, and now he's occupying Harold, freeze it, which allows Luca to drive. If he never seals in the paint, Luca has it. Harold would help. He'd have to kick it out. But because he's not, Luca gets to the rim and gets the shot. And again, just do your job, sprint down, give me some room, I'm Luca. I could get my shot off. He just did his job. That's, we watch Philadelphia, we watch- Eight minutes, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, do your job. Do your job. Yeah, I, 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 I will say something. Uh, Chris, Chris was talking about, if you're a Mavericks fan, you got to be excited about Pazingas going forward. That kid is really trying. He's playing with great energy. He's playing with great effort. If you're a Dallas Maverick fan, and my boy Mark Cuban, with Porzingis and Doncic going forward, I, hey. you, but but they, well, first of all, they're not. I was going, saying Portland and Dallas both are going to have the same energy against the two LA teams. Listen, first of all, it, 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 the Clippers are going to beat this team. This is this was a bad matchup. Uh, okay, well, it, 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 the game hey, is about it's, matchups. We're only in game one. That's I agree with you, Chuck. Uh, the, the, the the fans of Dallas do have. Three people to be excited about, not just uh, <laughs> who's, who's the third. Oh, the third is y'all call him Boba and Marjanovic. I call him you rang. <laughs> Roll the footage of my boy, you rang. Oh, we got dominated. more Bobine. Listen, more Bobine. Uh, listen, this is the you, you know time where we play a lot of pick and roll basketball, but this kid can play. Listen, that's a legal pick coach. too. It's not a legal pick, right here. What do you do, big that's man? No dribble. That's a t- jump hook his ass to death. You rang. <laughs> Run the floor. Like- you rang. Still, you rang. That's it. Oh, oh yes! Sweetie. You Great ain't thing. can play. You, you, People you in Dallas, if you don't dr- address him by his real name, <laughs> you rang. You being disrespectful. Throw it down, you rang. <laughs> Throw it down, you rang. <laughs> you better say his name, Chuck. <laughs> Yeah, that man a star right there. Uh, I'm not going to lie. He, he, he can play. He can, he can uh, actually, but you know what? He's a perfect example of a guy who's just out there working hard. Mm-hmm. You know, Doing we, his job, we, as we get, Ken you know, said. But we, Ernie, one thing that's, that sucks about sports, we get so enamored of guys who got talent. And Ken and Shaq know, I'm playing with 25 guys 
who had who probably could have been an all star or better, but were dumber than rocks or didn't work hard. <laughs> they were what? The, dumber than rocks. <laughs> uh, yeah. But but so that's but, one word. No, coming you, to rocks. I mean, hey, Doug, Doug <laughs> Collins. Coming to rocks. It was Doug, one Doug, word. Doug, I had to catch it. Doug Collins always talks about energy. Energy is one of the most underrated work ethic and energy are two of the most underrated. Like a guy like Montrez Harrell, who's the most arguably one of the most energetic players in the NBA. He's made himself a good NBA player by just working hard, energy every night. Clippers, rocks. Yeah, Clippers trailed at the half of game one, won the game. In fact, they are 14 and 14 this year when they trail. Yeah, well, Zing is not getting the out of this. I know we got some tweets. Come on, America. We're on the, on the other side. Come on, America. <laughs>